so now guys we will going to teach you how you can edit your uh, you know custom gpt so uh, let me just teach you from the scratch if you just go to chat.openai.com you will basically going to land up here okay so to edit uh, your gpt you just have to open your sidebar and you will go here okay click on your gpt so you will come to your custom gpt now many of you guys might think that we need to click on this pencil button but you can see here it's showing it's for new chat not to edit our custom uh, gpt okay and from the three dots also you cannot uh, edit uh, it okay so from where we can uh, edit our custom gpt so you can just click on this scroll down option and from here you guys will going to see we have the option to edit the gpt okay so you can simply click on that and then it will take you guys to this place now you might be thinking that what uh, where are the previous conversation which we have done with the uh, gpt builder so the answer is that uh, after it will going to be saved you cannot see it again so you can basically uh, while uh, giving instructions to gpt builder first time you can just simply copy and paste all the text and instructions to some place okay now uh, let's say uh, if you want to edit something so for example right now it's saying uh, it's saying digital marketing buddy so for example i can say hey change the name to digital marketing friend okay so i'm saying that i do not want buddy but i want friend click on enter button and you can see uh, now it will going to update the gpt you can see uh, digital marketing friend and you can see this converted to digital marketing friend okay and in case if you don't see any preview here so you can just uh, of course refresh it okay uh, to see the uh, new changes right and for example you can also say uh, here you can say fender humus seo and digital marketing guys and i can say here uh, also focus more on paid advertising okay click on enter so you remember that earlier i told that focus more on seo now i have also said him to focus more on paid advertising as well right so now uh, you can see it's updating the gpt so just wait for a few seconds uh, okay so that our gpt gets updated and here you guys can see i have updated digital marketing friend to focus on paid advertising anything else you want to change or add so in in this case you can just give the instruction to gpt builder okay and on that basis it it can help you to change anything uh, in your gpt builder or custom uh, builder okay custom gpt sorry and you can also add something if you want to uh, in your uh, custom gpt like we have changed the name okay to digital marketing friend and we have added one new feature like we have said to add paid advertising now the thing is that where all these settings will going to uh, store okay so answer is very simple you can just click on this configure option so just click on this configure option and here you can see the digital marketing friends from here also you can change anything and whatever we are doing here okay in the gpt builder so all that instructions are getting stored in the instruction tab so of course you cannot uh, expand it but uh, you can click on this uh, large dots okay to uh, open the view in the more bigger way like this okay so here you can see whatever we have set it's uh, doing it uh, it's tags okay so you can see uh, as we have uh, told uh, it to uh, focus on you know seo and paid advertising so you can see it has uh, done that done that same uh, thing okay
okay so uh, in this way uh, my friends uh, you guys can take the help of it and of course you can click on this close button and if you want to add something here you can also do that right so in this way uh, this uh, stuffs work and it's very powerful configure settings there are a lot of things uh, we will going to uh, of course tell you later on but that is how it works and of course if you want to update it you can just click on the update button but before that you can click on these three dots okay to delete your gpt to undo the uh, action or to copy your uh, uh, custom gpt url okay but now let's click on the update button only me click on confirm button and you will see everything will go good to go you can still customize it or you can just view your gpt from the front end right so that's how it works uh, and hope you guys have uh, basically understood about um, you know uh, how you can edit your custom gpt right so let's uh, just uh, uh, go back and here we can you can see that we are here okay uh, to the custom gpt of course just for safe site you can also uh, refresh it that's totally up to you right but uh, in this way my friends you guys can edit your custom gpt if you want okay